Evil things, Christmas gift and stolen time. We're going to have a lot of fun with this camera. What's the matter? It's the most thoughtful present. You didn't even give me. Ah, I know it sounds crazy. That a watch could ruin someone's life. What are you doing? Ah, help me. I don't know what's happening. Some people believe that some violent death can play over and over. I was positive I was losing my mind. Ah, Justin, hello. Sink by Dom. A quick eggnog, of course. Remember how it destroyed my stomach last year? Drink up. It's worse than not. It was worth the nausea. Merry Christmas. Cheers. It's Christmas Eve, I guess, about 15 years ago. A dating Tom, about three years by then. Every year at Christmas time, he went completely insane. It was pretty adorable. No. What? This is back before everyone smartphone cameras in their pocket. Tom, how did he pay for this? I really want a video camera, but he's pretty, pretty much flat broke. He said, way well, nicer than what do I got you. Thank you. I was thoughtful present you ever given me. Just let me just let me borrow that next weekend. Yeah. Anytime you want. Here, say something. Oh, we want to have a lot of fun. Could have a lot of fun in this camera. Oh. Are we? I think so. Couldn't wait to see it use it that weekend. We had a tradition of going camping. My friend Nat- 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 Natasha and her husband, Jake, right after Christmas. A lot a lot colder. It was last year. Yeah, probably why we only ones out here. No kidding. Every year we were a little deeper, go a little deeper in the woods. You know, get away from the crowds. Didn't see a single other campsite on our way in here. Yeah, well we're idiots. I thought we banned the, the guitar. Oh, I've been taking lessons. You love it. Mm hmm. Could always shoot a music video. Please don't encourage him. That was horrible. Gosh. Can I tell him? No, tell us what. Are you pregnant? I like. I had like five beers, idiot. Oh, we're starting a business together. Really? What is it? It's a restaurant, sort of. Sort of, actually. It's more like a mobile restaurant. Restaurant. What are you talking about? Instead of an actual restaurant, we're going to sell food out of a truck. Go park around different places and sit in a food truck. Yeah, 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 exactly. Terrible idea. Nobody wants to buy food from a truck. Well, that's, we, well, we think you're wrong. I'm not wrong. That was close. I mean, of all the times you've ever got, cam- you ever gone camping out there, we never heard a single wolf. I don't see anything. They hurt. They must be in the tree line. Oh, wait. This thing has an infrared setting. We've, then it just stopped. Gonna sleep. I'll go to sleep great tonight. A few hours later, Everyone's fast asleep in the tents except me. Tom? Mmm, did you hear that? Mmm, mmm. Used to hearing other cameras, you know, partying, having fun. This sound didn't sound like that. This sound was like a scream. The next afternoon, we went to the long hike. We were almost back to the camp when wall guys check this out. Whoa, creepy, yeah. Doesn't look like anyone's lived here for a long time. That's a good thing. Yeah, so you think we should head back? Yeah, give them some private time. Let's them talk about their food mobile wagon. Dude, it's a truck. It's a food truck. Nobody cares. I remember I was glad. Tom wanted to head back because it was going. Good, it would be dark soon. I thought Jake and Natasha were going to be a couple of minutes behind us. It was almost ten o'clock. They got to be lost. They're not lost. Probably just having sex. That's not funny. Been camping with them hundreds of times. They've never done anything this stupid. Oh, all right, all right. Let's go find them. Thank you. It was pitch black and Tom, and he brought one light. So we used the camera and got them for Christmas so I could see in the dark. Jake, Jake, Natasha, 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 Kara, Kara. Somebody out there. What? What do you mean, someone? Who? It was. It was a woman. She was she was crying. Who what, who was it? I don't know. Hey, what's going on? I heard you screaming from far away over there. Yeah. There, she saw a woman, really? Yeah. Who, what? Who, you guys didn't see anyone? No, nobody. Hello. They didn't need to say it. It was obvious that they thought. I imagine the whole thing. Hike. Uh-huh. Nice. 
Not that I blamed them. That was good. She was just crying. Cara? Yeah. Yeah, she just, she looked really scared. She's running away from someone. Don't know. I think I heard her crying. It was last night. What? In the middle of the night. Okay. So either there's some woman running for a guy trying to kill her in the woods, or there's some schizophrenic lady who may or may not stab us in the sleep. Not quite. I'm not sure which one I like better. Well, I'm up to see that yeah, I'm just crazy. I pay it off. I paid it off. That's no big deal. But I couldn't stop thinking about her. Do you hear that? I think I heard her crying in the woods last night. Natasha, Jake, Natasha. I saw. I knew what I saw. I couldn't ignore the fact she was a woman out there alone and afraid. Somewhere near the cabin was seen. So I grabbed my camera, went back out to where I saw her. Where I saw her here. And what I could say, I hope someone would help me if I was in trouble. This time I called the whole thing. Hello? Are you out there? Hello? I've got to have a lot of fun with this camera. This thing was a very afraid of setting. Natasha? Is someone out there? Here. here. Hello, hello. I heard crying. Something there? I mean, just for a second. But I definitely heard you. Uh, do you need some help? I'm not going to, I'm not going to help you. I was completely freaked out. I ran all the way back to the camp and woke someone, everyone up. Come on, okay. Let's just, let, just help, let me help you. Hey, are you okay? No, Todd, I'm not okay. There's something going on. No, look, right here. Press play. Press play, okay, okay. Don't, don't believe it. Couldn't believe it. That doesn't make any sense. Just look at one part cuts out. There's nothing but static. But, but only when we called it a man and a woman. Man, how many beers have you brought, brought, have you had tonight? I had two beers like five hours ago. I swear to you, I'm not lying. You believe me, right? Yeah, yeah, of course, fine. It just be the car. I'll be in the car till morning. Next morning, I convinced Tom to go back to the cabin. we have seen him. So he said he was, he was bleeding, right? You said he was bleeding, right? But there's no sun in him. No blood, nothing. Tom and I drove the four hours home, barely saying anything. Next morning, I called my friend Mike, who's camera guy at a local news station. I thought he might be able to explain it. I can't explain it. Great. I mean the fact that it goes to static. At those exact moments, it's, but it's still recording. I don't know. I mean, it's not like an he's accidentally taped a button. Uh-huh. No, I don't know. Sorry. It's okay. I asked Mike if I could borrow out one of his cameras. Apparently, I wanted to try. I knew I should see... I was seeing things that weren't recording away the camera, but I wondered they were, would record it on another camera. I put it lens of my camera, viewfinder of mine. I wanted to make sure Tom witnessed it for himself, so I filmed us sleeping. I knew it was, it was stretched, but it was a stretch for its explanation. I left it record all night, two seconds of static. It started it exactly the same way it did when they saw those people in the woods. So I fast forwarded it. So he's put on Mike's camera so to see what was there. I think I heard my crying was last night. Just that one part gets out. I expect him just more static. Oh my god. Torn. I must have watched that tape 50 times. I'm sure it's the same man I saw in the woods. How is it even possible? I have no idea what, what is, what it, what it, that is. But I guess I should tell you something. Oh, I got you a camera. A police auction. What? I got a dirt cheap a police auction. I couldn't afford a new one. So I went online and found someone to sell, sell me, pa- sell me the packaging for five pa- dollars to make it look new. Tom, you're the weirdest person in the world. Let's go. Why are we going to the police station? I need to find out who owned the camera for me. Thought maybe this is something to do with what I'm seeing. Our idea was how his, how his thing found his way out of the evidence room. Yeah, this should have not been in the audition. Why not? He belonged to a pretty bad guy. Was he murdered? Yeah. I don't think I really wanted to know the answer to my next question. But I had to ask. Did he, and he killed a man and a woman, tied one of them up? Sure looks like it. And did he film it with a camera? Yeah. I read about something, I read about, I read about something called, 
read about something called vigil, 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 vigil energy. Some people believe that a violent death can be over and over, like a movie that never ends, I don't know. Maybe it's true when somehow the energy got inside. It's like inside a camera, a film, two people being murdered. Help me. Ah, the same camera my boyfriend gave me for Christmas. Why don't I have a lot of fun this Christmas? Might make me sound crazy, but I have no, I don't have any other explanation. To you, don't understand the things that happened. So it's hard to talk about. Really? But you should really try cooking for ourselves someday. Why is that? It's, no, it's what normal people do. Oh, yeah. I don't like cooking. You're all for it. Tina and I have been married for just over a year. It was good. First year was good. So the thing that they said they were too tired to talk about last night. We're going to talk about it tonight. Mm. Talk about, mm. you know, just, you know, I mean, really, I mean, donate 100% of time taking care of someone who hadn't even met yet. A little crappy childhood. A real crappy childhood. So not having kids of my own wasn't really high on my list. I think they just keep pushing off. We're never going to feel like we ready to have kids. That's kind of how it works, you know. Just jump in. Justin always carried a lot of baggage because of his dad. I was hoping I could eventually convince him he wasn't anything like his father. Morning, Michelle. Morning. Hi. It's Justin. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, first, the idea why it's Sheriff with some in some small town in Matana will be calling me. Really? He said he found my father in some cabin in the middle of nowhere. He'd been dead for about two weeks. He walked out. My mum and me when I was six, packed the bag and left. Just, just basically disappeared. And he was, I mean, he was, I mean, was he alone? Yes. I see. Uh -huh. If you want to ship it to me, I can reimburse you. He said you sent me these things. You didn't want them. But well, it wasn't much thinking. Yeah, I'm sorry about that little loss. I don't know why I didn't tell him just to throw it all in the trash, which I had. Nothing ever changed since I was a kid. Just I went, I just went into my life without him. Then a package arrived, a single envelope. Guess he really didn't have much. Oh yeah, you've been such an old fact in my life. Didn't use it really. Didn't wasn't sure I really wanted to find out what he left behind. It's some crumpled up receipts and old watch, he said. i never leave you. Kind of ironic, right? What? This is Justin. I have no idea why you're shouting from Tanner. You're calling me. You want to ship it to me? I can reverse you. Why? Why? What? I feel like a joint. Don't, I felt like a jolt from my head. Like a Uh I'm sorry. Uh, it doesn't hurt. Not exactly sorry. I, I remember thinking, maybe I just am more upset than I think I am. It's okay. Um, he clearly bothered the second I saw that watch. After I opened that package, I didn't stop thinking about my dad. The description of the watch mean, you think? Was it a message meant for me? If it's installed yet, it's still which is still the software fishing program we discussed morning with Rhonda, Rhonda and Mike. Oh, I can't tell you. Don't, can't tell you for joking. I can't tell you for joking. It's supposed to be done ED, EOD. I don't know what Tom, Tim was talking about. Oh, yeah. Yeah, of course, man. He's right. There's an email chain, including emails, what I sent. I just I can't remember any of it. I figured it's distracted by some everything that was going on that night. I'm walking in the door. Hey, babe, hey. You look real cute today. Tina's watching TV. The next thing I know, I blacked out. What's the matter? Nothing. I'm good. But it's still awake, I think. I just don't show anything. But you explain... That was playing back at especially prolonged ones. Are you talking about? Okay. Do you drink much? A couple of nights a week? You obviously look, need to look into this further. In the meantime, I could completely avoid alcohol. Got to the bottom of it. For a couple of days, things went back to normal. I thought it might be over. A bunch of us were heading to, to Thursdays for happy hour. Oh, oh, I'm good. I'm not drinking night now. Okay. You're eating wings and watched, but, I know you watching Wings and watching, watching Boss World. Come on, it's almost six o'clock. Yeah, good point. Okay, let's do it. Blowing off steam was exactly what I needed. This will be, that, this will be fun. See, tomorrow, not even, so even though I couldn't drink, 
I went out with the guys, but it did it happen again. What? What's that matter? When I woke up, I had no recollection of anything, no clue. Hey, Ashley, is it obvious something was up? I had no idea what. Thank you. Dude, what's happened to you? Tim, what happened? I still don't, I couldn't decide. I still haven't decided if I'm pressing charges. Pressing charges? What are you talking about? It was you. I pretend, I pretend I didn't remember too. Tim, what are you, you're, what are you scaring me, man? What, what do you mean? What happened to man? We were watching the game at Fursies, and he said that Johnson was an awful point guard. He went nuts over the game. Don't care about basketball. Cut the crap, man. Stop pretending you don't remember. Never hit anybody in my life. Life, Charlie, Tim. Don't know what's, what's happening, but I blacked out all that night time. Don't remember. Tell me what happened, please. You got in, in my face. I finally told you to back off. You sucker punched me twice. Everyone saw it. Bounces threw you out up there. You're home late as late. Have you noticed anything strange about me lately? No, I'm all usual. What? Something really wrong. What do you mean? I don't know. I don't, I know. I don't, I keep, I keep, don't know. I keep forgetting things. I think you need to get some more sleep. Come to bed, okay? I don't know why I to tell her what was going on. And maybe I was just scared to say it out loud because I did, if I did, I'd be able to deny it. I wouldn't be able to deny it anyone. Anymore, Justin? What's the matter? Still have decided to press charges. Just in charges. Something really wrong. Justin, Justin, wake up. What? What are you doing with that hammer? His eyes are wide open like he was sleepwalking. No, 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 you're okay, I'm sorry. You okay? What's a what? Oh, no. Why in the hell did you have a hammer? I'm only hurt at my friend Tim. God knows whatever happened. I was scared and still haven't showing anything. Tim, Tina didn't wake up when she did. I'm sorry, doctor, gave me a referral to psychiatrist. You couldn't get me, couldn't get me in for like three weeks. What are you not doing? You need to sleep. In here, and you need to lock me out. Just in case I sleepwalk again. What am I supposed to think of this? We just we got married. We're supposed to have kids. You want to lock yourself? No. Just to be do it okay. Give given how Jane just in acting I was happy to lock him into out of the bedroom. I had positive I was losing my mind. I called and looked to took the rest of the week off work. I just trust couldn't trust myself around people. Trust is I didn't trust any myself around myself. Tina Pound, come please, please, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You know how worried I've been. Oh God, you're okay, you're okay, of course. I'm okay. Have you, uh, where were you last night? Justin, I don't know. Is it, it wasn't Tina's blood. It was, it wasn't mine. Why are you calling me? Tina, are you okay? I'm fine. What do you want? I mean, I'm sorry. Man, do you don't know what I've been going through? Don't care what you've been going through. Yeah, I, locked, I, I didn't look online. I found, I found anything. I couldn't find anything about a crime, about a crime in the neighborhood. MPD District, Precinct 101, Queens. Yeah, I just needed to find out about assault, what happened in the Queens last night. Name the victim? I don't quite know. Sir, you are the victim. No, no, not me. Nothing has been reported. I don't know what else to do. I called my mum. I asked her to come over. I'm scared, mum. I'm scared, mum. Where did you, when did you start? A couple weeks ago. She blamed my dad's death. You were emotional, physiological response. I don't have an emotional response. They have a major response. I guess uh, when I got a package for his stuff, what package? I guess it's every, with everything that was going on, I, I had to forget to tell my mum about a watch. I never leave you. It also the so first time I'd bothered looking at the over seats. This, that's that's the same day. That's the day he left us. He bought that watch the same that same day. He walked out on us. A receipt said watch with prescription, which meant the watch was already described when he bought it. I guess he hoped, I guess I hope my father had watched the squad himself. I tried to contact the pawn shop. But the dry, the owner died years ago and they shut the place down. My dad ran away from his family the day we got the watch. He died alone in the cabin. Did he learn leave because he's trying to protect us? It I know it sounds crazy. That watch could ruin someone's life. So I drove upstate and threw it into a creek. I promised myself I'd never tell anyone now. Tell only one way. I had no idea what I did that night. I was covered in blood, but I do know 
After I got rid of that watch, I never blocked backed out again.